Heavenly Father, at this time in the late hour of the day, we are making confession from the depths of our heart that we know by the word now that you've always cared for your own. But the trouble, Lord, do we care? Do we just want to get an education and say, well, I've got a doctor's degree or, or LLD. That's knowing the prescription. That isn't taking it. God, I pray the day that each one of us will take the sorrows of Christ into our own heart, take his suffering upon us to realize that we must suffer also the reproach of his name. That we must suffer. And may we be like the disciples of old. Return rejoicing that we have been counted privileged to bear the reproach of his name. Grant it, Father. I'm going to pray for the sick, Lord. Laying hands upon them. They've got their hands up, many of them. And many's going to be prayed for and holding prayer cards. And some's in here that didn't get any time for the prayer cards. But they're, they're, they're going to believe, Lord. They could put up their hands. Look like to me a whole congregation. Many of them are sick. Here's these handkerchiefs laying here. Feeling your divine presence by the anointed word. Heal them, Lord. Grant that their request will be answered. And now, from the handkerchiefs to the audience, to human beings who are sitting out there suffering, oh, the presence of the Lord, let it come Father, and heal them all. Will you this morning in divine grace, when we confess, Lord, I, your servant, I confess an inability. I don't even have one thing, Lord, that I can present to you as a merit. We are unworthy. None of us can do that, Lord. We're not worthy for the things that we're going to ask for. But, Lord, we know that Jesus went away up into glory and there preparing a place to come and receive us unto himself. And he told us that he would send us a comforter, which would be the Holy Spirit. And he would do his work and would abide with us forever. Oh, Holy Spirit, Spirit of God, come afresh this morning upon us. And to vindicate your presence, Lord, in the same manner that you did when you walked here on earth, that this audience might know that you are here in these last days to vindicate your word and to prove that as it was in the days of Lot, so shall it be at the coming of the Son of Man. Lord, it's to your honor and glory we ask this as we submit ourselves to you with our confession. Cleanse us by thy blood, Lord. Wash us by the water of the Word and cleanse us in the blood and present us, Lord, as examples, as Peter said in the text reading this morning, to the unbelieving world. For we ask it in Jesus Christ's name. Amen.